who you got, Dirk or Young Boy? Young Boy, duh. You tripping? Dirk albums go way harder than Young Boys. Plus, don't Young Boy got like 17 baby mamas? Boys, baby mama got the winners in music. Everything. I'll take Dirk over Young Boy any day. Don't Dirk got like four baby mamas himself? Tana can break the tie. Tana, who you got, Dirk or Young Boy? <laughs> What's wrong with you? Nothing. Well, now that that's over, does anybody want any chicken nuggets? Tana, what's wrong? This girl pushed me down the bus stop. Yeah, but I'm ready to go home. I'm tired of yeah, this. Yeah, very good. Poor boy. Ow, why would you do that? Ooh. What you gonna do, cry about it? <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, look, look. <laughs> and no one helped me up. They just laughed. It was so embarrassing. Girl, where are you going? To find the bully. Oh, good. Now you're perfect. Go in the car and grab the rest of that stuff. What stuff? The stuff for the party later. Maya and Tana, go help her. A party? Yes, I invited my team lead and some other very important people from my job that I need to impress in order to get this promotion. And while I'm thinking about it, I really need y'all. We know, you need us to fake a smile and be on our best behavior. No, I need y'all to go in the room and don't come out until the party is over. Well, everybody except for my sweet baby Tana. I just know her face is gonna for sure win them over. What? Why we gotta be punished just so you can impress your little corny work friends? Because I said so. Now my team lead has a daughter that's right around Tana's age. So hopefully they hit it off. That's gonna earn me some more brownie points, okay? Tana, uh, go get your Easter dress. But it's itchy. Girl, go put that Easter dress on. And make sure you wash your behind before you put it on there too cause y'all know how y'all like skipping baths. Go, go get the stuff. Shoot. This is lame in so many different levels. I don't know why you mad like you don't be in your room all day anyway. Yeah, by choice, it's a different feeling when you're forced to be in your room. I don't remember I was the cute face that won everybody over. Yeah, it was me too, until you came along. Join the club. Now I wonder who this bully is. I mean, what are you gonna do about it? They're eight. Girl, I don't care. They shouldn't have put their hands on my sister. Period. Tana's gonna have to learn how to defend herself eventually. But right now, she's not. So, I'll gladly do it for her. You're really gonna fight an eight-year-old at your big age? Look, Maya, I don't expect you to understand because you're the middle child. Hope they like Ritz crackers. Here's your chin. Look at so cute in her dress. Thanks. Question for you. Okay. What's up? You need to impress these people for a promotion, right? Right. I really need you to get along with Mimi's little girl. I heard she was a little bit of a brat, but just play nice. Right. So if things go well for you, you get paid extra. That's what a promotion means, right? Uh, yeah, that's what it means. I see. What I'm trying to say is, what's in it for me? What you mean? You gotta have a place to live, right? Food on the table, clothes, shoes, water. Eh, those are basic responsibilities as being a parent. I think in a personal parent, like from you to me, from my participation. Tana, get out of my face. Suit yourself. Okay, how much you want? A hundred dollars. A hundred? Fine. Smart decision. Now let's get you this promotion. Get my face. Oh, shit. 
shoot, they here. You need me to get that? Nah, if you don't get back in that room. I was just asking. <clears throat> uh, uh, well, hello, and welcome to my humble abode. <laughs> uh, uh, this is my daughter, Tana. Hi, Miss T. Hi, Miss Shay. My mother told me so much about you. I hope all nice things, right? <laughs> Of course. So even nicer than she described. Oh, really? Thanks. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, dinner's not quite ready yet, but I do have some hors d'oeuvres prepared right this way. <laughs> what is a humble bone? She don't need talk like that. And she never made no hors d'oeuvres for us either. Oh, uh, I hate when people put their fake professional voice on. Oh, uh, uh, please have some cheese and crackers. I had the cheese imported from Italy. <laughs> oh, is this Dolce cheese? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's a Dolce. <laughs> Welcome to my humble abode. I don't really talk like this, but my imposter syndrome is just taking over my body. <laughs> Is someone else here? Uh, uh, no, I think I must have left the TV on. <laughs> Tana, could you go shut the TV up? I, I mean, um, off. <laughs> Turn the TV off. <laughs> it's good cheese, right? And you must be little Miss Tana. This is my daughter, Tamaya. Excuse me. Hmm. I guess we'll just let ourselves in. Look at this. This is some good cheese, ain't it? Hi. Oh, hi, Miss Mimi. Welcome. Where's Tana? Oh, I think she had a bathroom emergency or something. She kind of just ran off. Uh -huh. Well, anyway, this is my daughter, Tamaya. Mom, where's Mr. Wiggles? Here you go, sweetie. Where's the real food? Oh, uh, it, it'll be ready soon. Oh, Derb? No? Okay. <laughs> She's here. Who's here? The bully from the bus stop. Well, ain't God good. Now I don't gotta go find her. Wait, you can't go out there. You brought my mom's party and my hundred dollars. You got mama to pay you a hundred dollars to stand out there and look cute? Yeah, nice though when I told me to do it. You used to get paid too. Closed mouths don't get fed. Why you ain't never tell me to ask? Girl, I'm not worried about that right now. I think I just figured out a plan to get to this Tana! bully. Make sure your phone is close. Girl, what you about to do? You mean what we about to do? And this includes payback for mom making us stay here during her little party. Now that's something I can get behind. Excuse <laughs> oh, me. Tana, where have you been? I went to go turn the TV off. Oh, okay. Well, have you met Tamaya? Uh huh. Okay. Oh, 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 that's dinner. Uh, everybody just take your seats and I'll fix your plates for you. Oh. Uh... Oh, my little bumblebee, she's just so honest, and that's just how we raised her. Be honest, no matter what. Shut up, Mom. Don't <gasps> talk too much. Okay, pumpkin. See? Just so honest. Oh, Tana, um, take Maya to the living room. Actually, Ma. I would like to stay with you, close where it's safe. Girl, take her to the living room, like I said. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Now, I know in the 70s they called it manners, but mm -hmm. nowadays it just sounds kind of uh, slave masterish. Hey! 
Y'all sucks. Mine is way bigger, but it's perfect for you. Small, wimpy little house for a small, wimpy little punk. I've been meaning to ask. Um, how did that dirt taste earlier? Excuse me, I gotta go. Hey, Ma, you think I can get the money now? Ma is dying to play Roblox, but I don't have any v -Bucks. Here. By the way, you're killing it. You think so? Because I can't really tell. Mm-hmm, 100%. You gonna answer my question or not? Uh, matter of fact, I got a better question. Have you ever tasted toilet water? What? I heard it was delightful. Now where is your restroom so you can find out firsthand? Uh, right this way. What kind of people have a restroom outside? So you're the one that's been bullying our little sister. And so, what you gonna do about it? And what kind of bully walks around with a teddy bear? No, Mr. Wiggles! Make that the last day you bully my sister. Mimi, please, let's talk about this over coffee tomorrow. Hard pass. I can't wait to tell the other colleagues about what happened here. Oh, and we're keeping the towel. Oh. Oh. That's my mama's towel. Tana, Maya, Tanaya! Hey, Mom, what you doing out today? Okay. Here, Mom, use the money I owe. Girl, I need it. Put it in my bread, baby. Hey, I heard you were the one that put it in my bread, baby. Oh, shit. <laughs> and that 90% of her pool, you should have heard her. Oh, <laughs> uh, Tana? You was like, Mommy! Oh, <laughs> uh, Tana? I think you need a chill. She's right behind me, ain't she? Hi, Maya. Go ahead, finish your little story. Actually, I was just wrapping things up. The end, sorry you missed it. I think you forgot one major part. What's that? The part when I... <laughs> <laughs> Where you been at? You was supposed to be here an hour ago. I was. Girl, you know what? I don't even want to hear that right now. Go in that room and put your company clothes on. We having company tonight. Why else would I tell you to put your company clothes on? Who's coming over? Tana, go. Mimi. I am so happy that you found it. The kindness in your heart to come back to my home again after what happened last time. And again, I am so, so sorry. Well, I mean, after 73 voicemails and all the emails <laughs> every day on my answering machine, um, I think this is the only way to make you stop. Hmm. Hmm. Tamaya! Hi. Hi, Mr. Wiggles. <laughs> Don't speak to Mr. Wiggles. I don't know you like that. Yeah. Mr. Wiggles doesn't talk to strangers. 
<laughs> Girl, Mr. Wilkins don't talk to nobody because he a tip. Y'all thirsty? Water, uh, juice, lemonade, or something? Well, I did already have some freshly squeezed lemonade here, so hopefully that works. Maya, where are your manners? I ain't know she had no manners. Sorry, Mom, I meant, Miss Mom, this is the worst lemonade. There you go, sweetie, use your words. Tana! Let's go and go check on Tana. Tana! <laughs> Tana! Tana, what is taking you so long? What you doing in here? You supposed to be getting dressed. I can't go out there. Oh, I'm sorry. I missed the part when I said you had a choice. But she's a bully. She's a bully? That's funny because I don't remember her pushing you in the pool. I remember you and your little ugly sisters pushing her in the pool. Y'all the bullies. But Ma, you don't understand. Oh, I understand completely. You had your gross sisters here and you was all big and bad. But now you by yourself and you scared. Ma, I'm telling you, it's not me, it's her. Tana, you got five minutes to get dressed or I'm coming back up in here swinging. Yes, ma'am. And have that apology ready. Apology? She needs to be the one that's be apologizing to me. Girl, talk back to me one more time. One more time. Okay? And see what happens. And if you talk back to me again, I'm gonna knock your fronts out. Tanner will be joining us shortly. <laughs> A little advice, if you will. Keep your kids away from that reality TV. What? Reality TV. She was watching Love and Hip Hop, right? With, with all the yelling? Yeah. Yeah, I'll keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. So you just gonna come in my house disrespecting me? Uh-uh, we ain't doing all right in here. Can't do it. Ah! Who am I kidding? I need backup. Oh, Tamaya, you like board games? No. Okay. Mom, this money house is boring. I want to go home. I know, sugar. Me too. But it's rude to leave before the food's done. Oh, I didn't know you invited more guests. Me either. Hey, girl. Thank you again for watching them. It's still light out. I probably could catch happy hour. It's her pleasure. Oh, and Kylie Mama said thank you too. I, I never said I could. I never said I could watch the kid. Hi, Mari. Hi, Kylie. Hi, Miss Marnie. It's nice to see you again. Let me tell you something. If you mess this promotion up for me again, I'm putting you up for adoption. Why would I do that? It's a party. The more the merrier. a little time to warm up, that's all. I gotta eat the rest. Uh, me too. Me three. I'm gonna go check on the food. Okay, we're here now, what's the plan? I say we jump them. Wait, no. We can't jump her. Then my mom for sure lose a promotion and I'm not trying to get adopted. That's where, so what are we gonna do? I don't know. She has my mom thinking that she's the victim and I'm the bully. I got it. You said your mom thinks she's the victim, right? 
Let's just expose her for the bully she is. That's a great idea. How are we gonna do that? We can't, um. <coughs> yeah, I got nothing. Whoa, back to the drum board. Nothing. <clears throat> oh, I got the uh, carrots imported from Africa. <laughs> oh, it's taking him so long. Oh, oh my coffee. God! <laughs> Kylie, Kylie, fall off the phone. This could be our proof. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're not so bad now. No, they're back there watching reality TV again. I gotta go get Pumpkin. I can't have her influenced by violence. Wouldn't want her to end up like your kids. Excuse me! Yeah, what up, you? Pumpkin! <laughs> Mommy, she was bullying me again! No way, she's lying. We have proof. Show her, Callie. I swear I recorded it, but I just can't find it. What? It's not there because it doesn't exist. My daughter doesn't lie. Well, Mimi, she's a kid. They all kind of lie, you know, that's what they do. <laughs> that's what they do. Maybe over here, you and your hoodlums do that in the ghetto. Okay, but at my house, we don't do that. Let me tell you something, okay? Because I let it slide when you said something about my kids at the dinner table. But baby, let me tell you, if you mention, you got one more time to mention them, and we're gonna have a problem. Is that a threat? Oh no, baby, it's a promise. I'll have you know our company does not take lightly the threats. And I'm reporting this first thing in the morning to HR. Yeah, so you can go ahead and start looking for a new job. Because you're out of there. Pumpkin, let's go. Touch me. Sorry. Way to stand up for yourself, Miss Money. Way to go, Mom. Way to stand up for yourself. I don't have a job. Where are you going? To go fill out your adoption paperwork. You think you'll still be able to go to our school, you know, being adopted and all? Really, Amari? Too soon. Too soon. Girl, do not play with me. Get up. You about to make me late. Late for what? You got your job back? No. Well, not yet. They done put me in this anger management class that I cannot be late for, so get up so we can go. Ma, can I stay home, please? Or you can just drop me out to school? Did you not just hear me say I'm running late? But, Ma, the bully's at the bus stop. What bully? I know you are not talking about Maya. That's exactly who I'm talking about. I am so tired of you lying. You the reason I'm in this mess in the first place. But, Ma. Tana, I don't want to hear it. You got five minutes to get dressed. Five minutes. Yes, ma'am. You got four minutes, Tana. Shoot. Miss Drea speaking. Yes, and, and I was just about to call you. You see, I might be about 10 minutes late because my daughter... Well, yeah, I understand that, but... My house? Why we got to do it here? Well, yeah, I get the, the incident happened here, but... It... Five minutes. Okay, no problem. Tana, you got two minutes to get out of here!
why you're here. You came here to apologize, didn't you? Mm-hmm. Well, it's a little too late for that. Because you done filed your little funky behind complaint, and now I got to do anger management this morning. Okay? So, how about you come back and render that apology later, and I'll make sure I'm not here. Excuse me. I see you haven't made much progress since our last encounter, huh? And I smell that you skipped the teeth brushing part of your morning routine. Now, like I said, I got anger management, so you got to go. You the anger, anger management counselor, aren't you? Yep. I'm here for your 8 a.m. evaluation. Well then, I don't know why you ain't say that sooner. Um, right this way, the living room's right over here. You know that, because you've been here before. You know what, right this way, uh, I have the couch set up for you right here. Well, I need to make a quick phone call. Um, so while you wait, uh, would you care for water, wine, uh, juice? Based off the lemonade last time, I'll pass. Tana, what are you doing? Ma, I can't go to school today. I just can't. Little girl, today is not the day for the shenanigans, okay? Now you done missed the opportunity to leave about the door. Good, so I can stay home. Oh, absolutely not. You need to go out the window. The window? Is everything all right back there? Oh yes, everything is just fine. Uh, the, uh, the phone call is just taking a little longer than I expected. I would like to go ahead and get started. Okay, well I'll be there in a minute. Quiet as a mouse. I mean, I bet not hear a peep. Who are you talking to? No one. Didn't sound like no one. You know, a part of built up anger is the inability to tell the truth. Well, that further proves why I don't need no anger management because I don't have no problems telling the truth. Uh, what's right now? Sorry, was that an elevated tone with a little splash of a Sharkeisha attitude? Achoo! 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 Jesus, is there a dog in here? Achoo! No one is in there sneezing. That's the TV! You remember reality TV? They always be sneezing on there. <laughs> sneezing and throwing drinks. Achoo! Achoo! Oh, wow. Your TV looks a lot like Tana. Hi, Miss Baby. I, I actually, I was just sleeping. Oh, no, 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 no. Stay. I'll write you a doctor's note. You can go back as soon as our session is over. Oh, wow. I didn't know you could do that. I don't even know what anger management is, but anything that keep me from your daughter bullying me, I'll take it. I guess lying just runs in the family, huh? Girl. And this further proves why I don't need anger management because if you were somebody up in the streets, girl, I would just... Get out my face. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Moose Mouth. Hey, Ma, you look lovely today. Nobody likes a butt kisser. Oh, sorry. Here's your money. What you still standing here for? Oh, sorry. Sorry, Maya, but my mama didn't give me as much money today because she told you taking it. So you don't have the money? No, ma'am. That's okay. It's not your fault. Really? Look here, I'm a naturally forgiving person. Thank you so much, Miss Maya. You don't know how much this means to me. But, uh-oh. I'm wearing a fair business here, and if I let this slide, what does that say to everybody else? I'm gonna hear excuses every week. Miss Maya, please, you gotta understand. And that's bad for business. 
Next. <laughs> Where's Tana? I don't know, boss. I don't think she came to the bus stop today. Where is Tana? Where is Tana? I know Tana is. I'm new to the school. Somebody about to find Tana always going to get wicked up in here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I completely agree. Okay, Miss Janet, I'll let her know. Sorry, I don't mean to be all up in your business, but let me know what. I've noticed you've had several outbursts since I've been here, and we haven't even started the session yet. So after careful consideration, HR has decided to extend your anger management sessions from three weeks to 10. Okay, let's get started. I'm sorry. Did you just say 10 weeks? I know, it doesn't seem like very much time, but with the right dedication, we can get it done. And I'm sure this will be great for Tana. Tana gotta do this too? I've realized now that the anger she has towards my daughter, it's a direct reflection from what she has to deal with at home, you know, with you. It must be torture having to deal with such an angry person every day. So, we're gonna teach her some coping mechanisms. What you can do is you can teach them little coping mechanisms to your spoiled, entitled little brat you call a daughter. Long 10 weeks. Tana, hurry up in that bathroom so we can get started. Get up! It's almost one o'clock and that bathroom is not gonna clean itself. I don't understand how you expect to get clean in a dirty bathroom. I just walked in there and I feel like I need to take me another shower. And clean up in here too. Okay, there's one bully I can't escape. But at least she feeds me. Um, can you clean a little faster? We gotta leave here by two. Where are we going? To the company's Labor Day cookout. Oh no is yes maya will be there and you better not lay a finger on her because i'm gonna lay my belt on you Tuh. she better not lay a finger on me girl is you talking back because i can smack you back until about an hour ago so you can wake up and start your day over again no ma'am i'll just stay far away from her look i'm already on my third strike with this company so please don't go out there embarrassing me because mommy will get fired which means we ain't gonna have no food or no clothes or no place to stay. And we're gonna be showering in public bathrooms. And no new toys. No new toys? Out of all the stuff. Just hurry up so we can go. And just like that, my weekend's ruined. cups of coffee at work the other day. Do you have any idea who's drinking it all? I can tell no. Well, here goes nothing. Two hours of that big professional voice. Janice! Oh my god, hi guys! Well, you look lovely today. It's hot out, right? I hate that voice. How long do you have to stay out here today? For as long as it takes me to keep my job. Ooh. Now, are you saying? Go over there with them kids and play. Hmm? <laughs> what were you guys talking about? Are you just gonna ask, just on your phone? I could have sworn you had a conversation before you. Teresa! Hey Tana, when did you get here? Just now? She's not here yet. You think she's coming? I heard it was mandatory, so I'm pretty sure she's on the way. God, please let her get in a non-life-threatening car wreck. Tana! What? I said non-life-threatening. Hi, Tana. Hi, hi. No sign of Maya yet? Nope, not yet. Tana just wish she got in a car wreck. I said non-life-threatening. 
I don't see a problem with that. What we really need to be doing is putting a plan together for when she gets here. An escape plan? No, a plan to stand up to her. I don't know about y'all, but I'm tired of getting bullied. Well, at least she doesn't have all the adults thinking that you're the bully. Speaking of that, how is your management going? I get to miss school, and I don't have to see my at the bus stop. How do you think it's going? Who are they? This is the kids section. Who are y'all? I'm Jen. I'm Leah. Our mom just transferred to this new job, and no offense, it's a downgrade. I can't believe they're having a company picnic at a community park. Seriously. Our mom's last job rented out Disneyland for a week. Disneyland? My mom been working here for 10 years they ever rented out Cece's Pizza. I don't know about y'all, but I'm trying to get some playtime in before Maya shows up. Who is Maya? The spine of Satan. That was intense. Y'all see when she gets here. Beautiful day out, huh, sweetie? I told you about talking to me. Oh, to only talk to you between the hours of 3 and 6. I didn't know it was only 2.55, I'm sorry. And yet, you're still talking to me. Well... Y'all got bullies over here? And she got the nerve to carry a teddy bear. <laughs> How old are you? <laughs> oh my. What did you just say about Mr. Wiggles? Guys, I think we should just go. Honestly, I don't get why y'all so scared of her. Wait, the teddy bear has a name? Well, I tried to warn them. I'm not sure how it works, but I think Mr. Wiggles gives her some sort of bully power. Does anybody else got something to say about Mr. Wiggles? Uh, actually, we were just leaving. The things are yours. <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> You're right, Mr. Wiggle. These swings are boring. <laughs> my turn. Actually, it's my turn. I said good night. You can go. Walk the trail. How did he just? Sorry, the trail's off limits. Me and Mr. Wiggles are working on our sprints. All 
had about enough you for one day. Go, Canada! I'm not sure where the booze of courage came from, but there is no turning back. Now get out my face. You little... Damn it! I told you not to come out here embarrassing me. I swear for Lord, when we get home, your behind is grass. What kind of kids fall asleep in the middle of a park? Wow, she's really good. <laughs> What's the score now? Bully three, Tana zero. I gotta figure out a way to expose that criminal. But how? have to hurry up and hide because they only give us like one minute to hide and then they go ahead and find us. And I'm like, in the store, I gotta hide somewhere like where they can't find us. So I... <coughs> Ma? Hmm. Hello? Nightmare. You think we should wake her up? Why don't we just. Tana, wake up! <laughs> oh, another Mr. Wiggles nightmare. Girl, calm down. It was just a dream. This is the third one this week. What was the dream about this time? Did he hit you with a car again? No, even worse. Did he shave off all my eyebrows? <laughs> what? That's like my biggest fear. Your biggest fear is getting your eyebrows shaved off by a teddy bear? Shut up, Maya. No, he broke in the house and attacked me. See, me personally, I could never let someone that carries a teddy bear around 24-7 bully me. But that's just me. Maya, please. I remember I had to stop Taisha from putting your head in the toilet. Taisha was 16 in the third grade. That's not the same. I don't know what to do. Every time she bullies me, nobody sees it. But once I try to defend myself, I get in trouble. This just sound like a case of, if you can't beat them, join them. That's a wonderful suggestion. Be a real bully and get in more trouble. Thanks, Naya. I'm not telling you to be a bully. I'm telling you to be her friend. How exactly do you want me to make friends with someone who wants to pound my face in every time they see me? The girl got a point. It's got to be something she liked that you can use. Maybe you could buy her another teddy bear. Why would she want another teddy bear? I'm just trying to help. But your idea is garbage. And your upper lip smells like garbage. Girl, I... Hello, let's focus here. To be honest with you, this seems like something you're gonna have to fix on your own. I mean, mom's job is already hanging on by a thread. Yeah, any more assistance from us may lead to homelessness. Try to find some common ground and just go from there. You got it. Here goes nothing. Just stick to the plan and find common ground. Ah! 
and that's where he didn't miss the wiggles. That was not a part of the plan. Now what was so important that I had to start Mr. Wiggles from his nap? I was thinking this rivalry brought out the worst out of both of us. Let's just let bygones be bygones and go on as friends. The worst? I've been having the time of my life. I just realized how easy it is to get money from your stupid mom. And I plan to get more of it. I'm sure we have a lot of things in common. It is absolutely no way that you think I will have something in common with you. It's not your fault that you're a loser. Look at your mom. Do you see how pathetic she acts around my mom? It's so sad. Look, I came to the park to make truce with you. Now leave my mom out of this, okay? Oh, the little baby is sad because her mom is a butt kisser. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I'm gonna ask you one more time to leave my mom out of this. Or what, huh? that Maya is a real bully. My prayers has been answered. Sorry, Miss Money. I was finally trying to defend myself. Wait, that is not what happened. Please don't tell my mom. She will be so disappointed. Don't worry, I won't. No way, she's falling for this. Mm-hmm. You done did all that bullying to that girl and think she was never gonna do nothing to you, did you? But Mom, that's not what happened. Lies. I saw everything. You charged at her, and then she put you in a headlock. Come to think of it, who told you you can come to the park? Oh, I... Stay in that room for a week. And don't forget to give me that tablet. Maya, you need a ride? <laughs> yes, ma'am. You know what? This looks a lot like the bike Lil Jay's been posting pictures about in the neighborhood. That's because she stole it from him. Yeah, me and Lil Jay got the same bike. Really? All the way down to the little faded Spider-Man head. It's his bike. I tried to help him look for his bike. I hope he find it. Aw, how sweet. <laughs> Get in the car. Maybe my mom is stupid. That's really the only way to make sense of all of this. She really has us riding with my bully in our car with a stolen bike in the trunk? If that's not stupid, I don't know what is. My mom's an idiot. I can't believe I'm stuck here on punishment just cause that devil child acted like she was the victim again. I don't know what you were here twiddling your thumbs for, but you're supposed to be reading. Reading. Oh. Oh, uh, hey, what y'all doing here? Um, so are you gonna let us in? It's a little sketchy out here. <laughs> uh, sure. Okay. Come on in. Come on, girls. Come on in. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ooh, it's a little, okay. Oh, excuse me, sweetie. Just scoot in just a little bit, please. Anyway, to what do I owe the pleasure? Is my car safe out there? Maybe I can, you know, you have any room in your garage? Maybe I can slide it in there for a little bit or? No! Well, as you know, we are new to the neighborhood, but unfortunately we had to downgrade to the lifestyle that we're currently not used to. Um, and so I reached out to Mimi and she said, possibly maybe you and Tana can give us some pointers on. Adjusting to your new job? Girl, between me and you, I think that our company needs a lot of work when it comes to the rent. Can you believe they got me an anchor man? No, adjusting to the ghetto. Living in the ghetto. Living in the ghetto. Adjusting hey. to living in the ghetto. And Mimi sent you to me? Well, I'm not sure I can give you any pointers on living in the ghetto. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're joking, right? Okay. Okay, girls, so go run along and find um, Tana's room. I'm sure it won't be hard. It's so tiny in here. Um, do you all share a room? You know? Just...
come in. What are you guys doing here? Our mom brought us here so you could give us some tips on going to school in the ghetto. Okay. This mattress is too soft. You really need to upgrade to memory foam. Yeah, I'm good. What's with the shades? What do you mean? Um, there's no sun in here. So, I'm actually glad you're here. I want punishment. For what? My mom thinks I bully my Wow, your mom's stupid. No offense. None taken. I mean, you can see that Maya is the problem from a mile away. Exactly! I just need you to tell my mom that so I can get out of punishment. We can't do that. What do you mean? Why not? Ever heard the saying of snitches get stitches? Come on, guys, you gotta help me out. How was I supposed to prove to my mom what's really happening? Sorry, we have a reputation to maintain. You mean the reputation of getting knocked out? No, she didn't. Okay, look, y'all can take whatever y'all want. I got these. What are those? Um, can I offer you anything? Lemonade, Kool-Aid? Mm. I'm okay. Thank you. You sure, girls? My Kool-Aid is good. You don't know what you're missing. <laughs> uh, you, you mean besides diabetes? No, thank you. Are you invited somebody else? Ain't full of pop-ups. Maya? Maya's here for a play date. Speak of the devil. And you can start a play date off with an apology. To who? For Maya. Sorry, Maya. That my mom's an idiot. Mr. Wiggles will like an apology as well, you know, for kicking him. Sorry, Mr. Wiggles. That you have such a dumb bully owner. Thank you. Now, y'all, play nice. Surprise. What are you doing here? Look, I'll come in peace. Yeah, right. For real, look, my mom is really sick and I'm trying to get off my mouth for a little while. It's weighing really heavy on my mental. I hate when she's down. I don't even have the energy to beat y'all down right now. That's comforting to know. So, what was y'all about to do? Um. We were about to play Operation. Oh, that's my favorite game. Can I play? Okay. Revenge is best served when you have least expected. Tanner, give me something to tie her hands up with. No, are you crazy? This is what you asked for, right? For us to help you get her back. No, I wanted to get off of punishment, not a life sentence. What happened to snitches get stitches? Yeah, we thought about it, but yeah, we boozy, but we ain't no pucks. You think you just gonna knock us out and get away with Sorry about that. It's okay. You know what? Most of the kids in the neighborhood are very well behaved. Nice. 
And your curls, they're gonna fit right in, okay? Cause they're nice, they're courteous, they're yes. well mannered. Yes. yes, yes, yes they are. <laughs> well, I mean, Tana did have this one thing with this kid named Maya, but I think now they, they might have gotten over it cause she just came on, just dropped on by for a play date. Not having heard any commotions since they've been in there. Oh, okay, <laughs> nice, that's beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> On one hand, Maya's finally getting what she deserves, but on another, I think she's turning on a new leaf. I gotta go help her. <laughs> Teach Amaya a little lesson on karma. We gotta let her go. Give me that. You know what? I have a confession. Maybe I have been a little hard on Tana. Well, you know, kids will be kids, right? Right. Uh, I'm gonna just go tell her she's off punishment. Yeah, that'd be good. Okay. Very good. Room. That's odd. The girl's not in the room. What do you mean? Oh my gosh, do you think maybe they've been kidnapped? Or maybe they just went outside to play? Oh my god, let's hurry and get them and bring them back in before they're involved in like a drive by. Come on, girl, where do you think we live? In the hood! How do you open this thing? With the latch. Well, did you like it? Did you comment? And if you're not subscribed, click the button, turn the bell on. <laughs> now make sure y'all come back and see me. Until next time. Looking at Maya. Shut, Shut up, Maya. Maya. Ready? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> the worst? I've been having the time of my life. Wait. Jay, move, please. <laughs> me, me, sit. You to me. I mean, is this a bad time? Should we come back later, or? <laughs> Girl, Okay, okay. Where's Tana? I don't know, boss. I don't think she came to school. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one more time.